we're back with more hate playing our way through Sea of Stars. I am talking to myself. This is Talking to Myself Gaming. Thanks for checking it out. We are level 14 and we're still in the Clockwork Castle. Oh, look at that. I'm glad that I picked it back up where I did. Alright, I am doing everything I can to keep my eyes open, so this one might end up being a half episode on my end. I hate this. At no point have we indicated that we could move both at the same time. Looks neat, though. I appreciate that it looks neat. What are they homaging the the battle at the bridge and 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 Final Fantasy V, right? This is admittedly cooler. No. Your wares aren't your dick, are they? So I'm going to introduce myself to girls in the future. Hey, you want to see my wares? And when they're like, sure, what are you selling? I'm like, oh, wares is what I call my dick. Oh, do I have two green leaves? Is that what it is? Climb on the watchtower. Clock tower. It's not even a clock tower. Why? All right, they came up. Wow. They were just inside her. Talk about nature's pocket. Jesus Christ. It's just a fucking clown car in there. Oh, they're doing it again. Oh, that's a hatch. I see. Oh, now they're talking. I'm not touching the dweller. Girl, and I've got you. Why are you even in my party? Because the DM couldn't watch us play the game without getting involved? Didn't trust us? I don't have a hammer fire spell. Why does it do this so frequently? Because this doesn't, this should have fire. This should do fire. Or I should start boss fights with a combo point. I don't know how I could have gotten that.
I'm not going to say that they're making it too easy now, but I am going to say that I appreciate that I'm allowed to do it. That is, break their attacks. And we're barely hurting it. Oh, I see. God gets to do all the damage. My favorite. I'm just buying time so God can beat it. It's my favorite. I don't even know why I'm doing damage to it, actually. I don't even know why I'm trying. Like, I'm not using... I'm not going to use her ultimate. It's no, no, no point. Because the machine is going up. Nope. At... Turn counts, it looks like, not damage thresholds. Maybe it's damage thresholds. Take a fucking piss break. God, this takes so long. Legitimately don't care that she's down. But I'm not going to just let him kill me. It's strange and frustrating. Oh, God. It's strange and frustrating to me how frequently these, these fights, just normal combat encounters, are balanced with the assumption that she's in my party. It might be how often I use the charge crystals, the boosts. Is this fight really over already? 
Just a scripted fight. Just a dumb looking eyeball. And then the aftermath. Why did we wake up in the aftermath? Why didn't it show us the like what was happening? This is not my POV. I am not this person. I am watching this happen. And so, because this was the aftermath of the battle in Final Fantasy V, this has to be the aftermath of the battle in this. It's just lame. It's just a lazy choice. Yeah. Just a scripted loss. I keep predicting these are going to... Yeah. God, you have to help. Help us, God. Again, wasn't Zael or Valir that did the desperate thing. And now it's the end of Final Fantasy VI. So it went from the bridge at the penultimate cool moment in Final Fantasy V to the bridge, or and to the end of the 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 world breaking in Final Fantasy VI, because it it's got to do this it has to go into an anime cutscene now it couldn't have done an anime cutscene of the thing destroying the tower and us falling in the big actual dramatic moment no we have to meet dickhead this is how they introduce satan and we don't know why this is happening it's just happening Yeah, the cosmic rules thing, that's an element of my own storytelling, and it's annoying me see them clicheify it and make it stupid here. Because, yeah, this is, this is uh, Zoroastrianism now. Why is, I don't need to be seeing this. Why are they having this conversation now? In front of us. It's not interesting that it hurts. They even had to tell us that this is interesting. It's not interesting. I wish I could skip this. I can't. I literally can't hit A fast enough. Oh, now he. Now, now we see why they did it because they. They, are getting a wish. Stupid. They didn't even get to say their wishes. They already have. In time. This is, again, this needed to happen inside the first two hours of the game. This all needed to happen in a cutaway...
A proper sidekick is in order. Stupid. Why does he get two wishes? Yeah, why are they talking to us? All of this has been happening like we're not there. Brew graves. Like, you don't even know who your people are. Like, the narrator here, the, 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 the fucking Ancient of Days is omnipotent and om, om, omnipotent and omniscient. And this guy doesn't even know what's been going on recently. He didn't even know there was a plan to... And of course, she's Darth Vader. Of course, suddenly she's interested in power. It's like, you don't wait until this long to give your characters motivations. And then they just leave. And of course, this is just a boss fight. A single hit. Bored. Bored and annoyed and bored and annoyed and bored and of course because Garl jumping and getting hit by Garl getting stabbed in the eye is supposed to be played as a sacrifice and so he's repeating his care but no he's not repeating his character arc and again this is just the god now now the DM is talking to himself so it's so perfect it's so perfect perfect that this is my first talking to myself game that i decided that this would be the first game that i indulge myself in talking to myself through because look we're just watching the dm be self-indulgent our fucking characters aren't even on the screen i hate this i hate this I haven't read anything since time froze and they walked off. I'm getting off these off the screen as fast as I can. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. At no point in Final Fantasy VI did Kefka talk to himself, have a long soliloquy by himself to himself. At the end of the game, he soliloquizes to you. Every time he soliloquizes about his plans, he's soliloquizing to you, the party. This guy's not talking. He never once talks to the party. He doesn't engage with the party. The party's insignificant to him. This moment is insignificant to him. No emotional weight. Just pisses me off. Gar's just hurt again. Who fucking cares? And now he's going Super Saiyan. Now we're going to have a long off-screen dialogue inside his head while everybody just watches nothing happen because, you know, they watched Dragon Ball Z that one time. And Krillin is the audience insert character, so of course their audience insert character has to die. I mean, he even f picked up his buddy and flew off. Oh, but she can do it too. She saw him do it, so she can do it. Because she's Vegeta. This couldn't be worse. This couldn't be worse. And because Terra flew away when she went into her, her Esper form, they have to. Of course, he's a bird. I hate this so much. 420. Smoke up. It's 420 somewhere. Hey, if you break your clock at 420, it's right all the time. You know what I'm saying? Oh, we're just at this spot. Oh, right. Of course we would come back to him for some reason. When death is near. Fucking cares. 
<coughs> Leaving this party this small didn't make it intimate. Well, now we get to see the perspective of the elder. I don't care. I'm not looking at the screen. I could get up and leave for all I give a fuck. <coughs> of course, there's a volcano. I just had a vision. Because, like I've been criticizing, he has no reason to be in this party. He has no magical gifts. He's just a fat ass. Let me out of this. They don't even they don't even trust that we remember what happened within the last 15 to 20 hours of gameplay. We didn't have to remember to ask for the the flask of borrowed time. There was no risk of a game over right here. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care why. Don't care what's happening. Couldn't care less. If literally I, I if I tried to care less, I couldn't. Come on, just blink out of existence, please. Just be gone. I hate you so much. Just be gone. Be out of this game. Give us a good character. Give us a good character. I saw stars in capital, so Sea of Stars, you know, showed up in the game. Ah, oh, they did it! They did the thing! I'm so happy for them. Let's make it day. Of course his name is Yeet. That's what he does. It's supposed to be funny. Where does he get the bottom half? Does he just have an endless supply of the bottom halves? Oh. That was hideous. Nope. I cannot progress the game without... Oh, this isn't Colony Island. Is it? The Skyward Sword Bridge. Oh, don't do it. You know better. Maybe I can get through one of these recordings without stuffing a bunch of fucking almonds in my mouth like a goddamn idiot. Stupid catches, you know, it's contagious. And this is that spot in Final Fantasy IX. It's much cooler in IX. Don't care. She doesn't know why she's doing this. She doesn't know how she's doing this. It's just happening because it's what the narrator, it's what the... It's what the over god needs to happen in order for the story to progress. Oh my god. I want this to move so much faster. Yes, it's a laser bridge. I know. I Oh, it's a water bridge because they, they heard about that story in the Bible. But seriously, this is so tails. Just come on. Can't walk on water. There's like no amount of water pressure pushing up that you would be able to walk on it, that it would be solid enough for you to walk on it. Wow, when I get stressed and angry, I, I just want to eat almonds. Oh, this is so boring. Oh, 
Oh, that's even... Isn't that Xenoblade Chronicles? It's definitely um, Mass Effect. Jesus Christ. Oh, we're back to we're back to um, the Legend of Gaia. That tickled. <laughs> Hate. Back to watching the clock. You know, it's funny. I said I like the fishing mechanic, and since I said it, I haven't done it on purpose. I hate this so much. Cloud Kingdom. We're back to Super Mario RPG. They can be very difficult would be an interesting warning to me if I had to roleplay. So like this wants to be going to the council or whatever it's called, the senate or whatever in Mass Effect to get their, their help and their approval to fight the, the alien bad guys, but that's not what's about to happen. You didn't give me enough items to be able to... You didn't give me enough money to be able to buy... Oh, you gave me exactly enough. Upsetting. Those feet could look a lot better. For as proud of they as they are of the idea that they've got here conceptualized. Oh look, they played Thor Blood and Thunder. Or watched Thor Blood and Thunder. <sighs> Celestial Giants. Saw that joke coming. Yep, we got Marvel fans here. He said the thing. Oh my goodness. And yeah, he's the over god even of the celestial gods because he's he's the first Jesus. And the, the first Jesus is the the Ancient of Days reigns high over the Archons. He's the Metatron. It's fucking annoying. 
I don't believe for a second they did that on purpose. I don't even get to pick. He just knows what it means, so it must be right. Because nobody ever makes the wrong choices in this game. Nobody ever has to stew over how they've made mistakes. Nobody has to learn anything. God, this can't be over fast enough. Just sitting here eating. God. I eat when I'm bored because it keeps me awake. Yeah, that went well. Of course it did. Yeah, it was going to be super difficult. Uh, I mean, it was tough for me. Hitting A that many times is going to give me fucking carpal tunnel. Hey, Hermes. Yeah, you know why he's called Punty, right? It's going to kick us. I can't go the wrong way. Oh, look at that there. They heard my complaint and they're splitting the party. Every time I complain about a missed opportunity in this game, it tries to capitalize on it immediately after. I don't even care what's happening or why. I don't care why he can do that. He's suddenly Naruto. Don't give a fuck. Impossible. He just stubbed his toe. And yes, they have an infinite number of those. Again, impossible. Great, my two least favorite characters. It's almost like they know. I'm constantly stopping to see if they've actually... Wait, what happens? Oh lame. The shadows aren't at a different angle. I can't go to the wrong place. It just... just why... There just won't be anything there. Just rolled my eyes so hard I went blind in my left one. Hmm. 
I guess that's what it means by plus one if timed. They haven't used the nomenclature timed before, so I didn't know what that meant within the rule set. Why is the music suddenly so upbeat? Because the music in the Sky Kingdom and Final or in uh, Super Mario RPG was upbeat like this. Oh, I saw it there. I was just hoping I could get to that campsite before I was forced to fight them. Because I would really like to not fight them. That would be my preference. Damn, I was just thinking to myself about how this has been fairly well balanced for two people and then it smacks me with massive AoE damage. Jesus. It's like they knew that that was there. My rat boy knows that I'm munching almonds and he's like, I want almonds. Gallon buddy. I'm not standing up. Next time I stand up, I'll give you an almond. I did not see that. I struggle with the perspective of this game. Conflagrate, huh? Yeah, they should probably have a combo attack, huh? You know how pissed off I would be if I've missed combo attacks? Course of exploring this island. 
Ah, uh, I see where I'm making my mistake. You know, I have legitimately not been looking to see if it's the case, but I think his sword has changed. Ow! Fuck you! God damn it. Cats. I think his sword is different every image, every sword that he gets, which means that might be the case for all of them. I have literally not looked. I hate looking at their sprites. Fuck that up. Stop. Damn cat trying to cut my arm off. I probably, let's see, I probably could have gotten a kill with this and not taken any of that damage. Instead, I chose to heal. Mm hmm. Yep, I just wiped. Mm. I love it that they're resistant to his attacks. But he and Douchebag here are the only two people in my party. Fucking lame. Oh, back in the day when I wanted eggs. That was a long time ago now. Triangular slab. Didn't mean to do that. If I can keep from fucking this up, it's going to work out anyway, but I did not mean to do that. I don't know how to know when I'm supposed to hit that.
Hexagon no slab. What do I want those for? What do I want those for? I didn't... Let me see. I was like, I haven't come across anything that I could interact with that says, this has a triangular slotted hole. It's because I didn't come across anything that said that. I wasn't going to come across anything that said that. Because heaven forbid. I mean, it was intuitive enough. I figured it out, but I couldn't have figured it out but without brute force. Wonderful. Saw that coming. Just, I like to do it. Familiarity with the dungeon and all that fucking utilize this less to cook and more to fuck this can't even get it wrong Oh, that's up. Again, I thought that was out. So that's up. Probably don't want to jump down. Turns out I do. Can I skip this? Can I just not? No, because I'm going to... Yeah. Fuck this. Hmm. I am so incredibly bored. I just find this so tedious. May as well.
this to be over so I can go back to solving the puzzles. I've been bitching that they don't have enough combat encounters immediately before puzzles and now that they do it I wish they hadn't. I also wish my rat friend would be done drinking from his little bottle. I guess I've almost stacked enough MP that he can use that three times. It's pretty cool. in my time by making this puzzle difficult. one get oh I see I'm being very quiet. Oh, I thought that was vertical. I was like, what? I'm so tired of these fights. I know I should have had him use his AoE heal. I'm gonna need to anyway. Oh, I might be dead. Love that. I also, it annoys me that he's got the merchant, his character design, damn Ancient of Days character design is the merchant from, uh, not the merchant, the chemist from Final Fantasy Tactics. Just bugs me. Like, the reason that anime and Japanese iconography relies on like the same images over and over is because they're using you're they're utilizing archetype so 
So the same images, the same icons, the same rough character, and then your thing is unique in how you use them. Hey, buddy. I'm just going to have... I'm All I'm going to be able to do is heal every turn. This is really starting to upset me. Like, why didn't that do the AoE thing? Buddy, can you please sit down? Frankly, I just got tired of healing. Nope. What is this? I don't know what it is or why I want it. It's a good thing he knows. Mystic Quest, also stupid. Is that what we came here for? This is why I came here. The Swan Song of the Warrior Cook is the title of this chapter, and that just had me stewing in wordless rage. Didn't even have any, I didn't even have a reason to be angry about that. It just upsets me. This game wants to take itself so seriously, which means it expects me to be taking this all seriously, like sitting on the edge of my seat and lo and behold, exactly what I said. Now the party is split. Well, we didn't even have to find their special combo. They just, they just gave it to me. 
I don't have enough money to Im I don't have enough money. Skills cost less. Defense way down. Why would I do that? That would be dumb. is just stupid wait she can do the thing so why couldn't they lead the party to begin with and how is it how is this item that does this this magic MacGuffin that allows me to do this and the the item the how how does she have these things it's an item that the party shares that we don't have four of them I guess Naruto good Jesus over here can duplicate items too I mean he's the deus ex machina why wouldn't he know the the duplicate items glitch please be over quickly Right. Man, I fuck her attack up every time. Why didn't that work? I don't know why that stopped. I probably could have blocked that, like prevented that, if I weren't a big dummy. Wow. 
Why did that warp? I don't know why that happened. This might be a wipe. Accidental click. I've been forgetting to use my boosts. Well, that wasn't too bad. For sure thought I wiped. Blah! Drops item. So stupid. No emotional investment. No reason to have done that. I mean, I guess I'm trying to save this. Di ah, this is why those encounters needed to be non-lethal. This, for the record, is so much less cool than the way they split the party in Final Fantasy VI. I think I can... Well, these are highly aggressive. Damn. 
And of course they're resistant. I hate that. Why? Why would you do that? I don't know if this is obvious, but I do not understand fucking Chemist Magus's attack. That pissed me off. I might not get that treasure chest. I don't want to explore a dungeon, dudes. I want, I want to get this on with. Why did you, you never tell me when the bracelet can push things. Literally, that's the DM. I'm not going to give the game props for making um, that vulnerable to her because it shouldn't be any other way. When you have the party, party split up like this, you're reducing your potential damage and survival. Your potential damage output and your, your survival by so much. Um, no. No! That wasn't what I meant to do. This is going to be AoE and it's going to wipe me. I actually don't know if my whistles are painful for you. I feel like I'm far enough away from the, the mic, but I actually don't know how loud it is. The only people who have ever complained about my whistles have complained that I'm whistling, not about the volume. Did you get food, Eunice? No, I'm just gonna eat the rest of these dumplings. If you're not going to. They're yours. Okay. I'm gonna eat these then. They're... I just have so little interest in this attack. Okay, well at least they're vulnerable to it. This is the wrong thing to do. But I'll just heal through it. Because for whatever reason, oh right, it's a, it's one of those gold accessories. 
I don't know what those are called or if they have a special name. I should probably heal in anticipation of this room having a boss fight in it. Why did you have an auto save at that zone line and a save point in the room? This is stupid. If the wind is strong enough to break these with this boulder, why isn't it just strong enough to break them? Because somebody thought this would be cool. What if everything about this game was super tedious and took a really long time to do, even if it's really uh, simple? This is what I was talking about three or four or five or however many episodes ago it was when I was talking about the importance of veteran leadership and knowing what parts of the game belong where. An elaborate puzzle dungeon is not what I want to be doing when my party is split up like this. I didn't know I had to push that. It's acting like there's supposed to be one right here. I see. Connects. Yeah, what I what I don't want to be doing right now is an elaborate puzzle dungeon. What I want to be doing is watching Gar die slowly. But what I'm going to do instead is and what I would would prefer if my options are limited to not watching Gar die slowly, what I would prefer is for this to be over quickly. given me no interesting accessories. Uh. Shouldn't be using this. I don't know why that's happening, but I got it to work. so tired of these fights. I don't know why that worked, what the timing was to make it work, but it worked, so whatever.
I need to be a good. I need to be careful. There's a good chance she dies from this. Mm. I don't really want to use her as a shield and heal bot because that's boring and he's supposed to not be a main character he's supposed to be hands off but again he's the he's the DM who's insecure that without him we won't be able to play the game we won't be able to make it through the game without him holding our hands throughout And I hate that. I couldn't hate that more if I wanted to, and I really don't want to. Why didn't that hit all of them? It said it was going to hit all of them. Yes, I thought it did. There's no penalty for letting her die right here. Now there is a penalty for letting him die. Oh, lovely. More sliding tile puzzles. Fuck it. This fucking song, the theme song to this area, has a tone in it that sounds like a goddamn 90s alarm clock. Some of their design, like sound design choices, just hurt my ears. It's so dumb that they've made me spend so much of my healing on this one. I would prefer not to fight that thing if I can avoid it. I can't avoid it. I actually tried to dodge roll like I'm playing a good game. Should have attacked the other one. I don't know why I made that choice. Well, now I'm in, in too deep. I swear to God, it's like my neighbor has left their alarm clock on in this zone. It's just one deet, 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 and the, there's just this high-pitched tone in this song. I don't know what the fuck they were thinking, having a rhythmic high- oh, look, we're making obsidian. I don't trust that the second I let my guard down, and I'm like, well, they haven't given me a boss, and all these other times I've been certain they were going to hit me with a boss, the second I let my guard down, and I, I think they're not going to hit me with a boss when I go up here, there's going to be a boss. I'm like, there, I thought for sure they wouldn't hit me with a boss right here, because this would be a weird spot to hit me with a boss. And look, the, mine, the mole people are back for some reason. Look at that. Look at that. Let's make some chaudray. Chaudray. And then. Ooh, I can make two of these.
because I don't use them often, but it's good to be able to bring somebody back up. I don't need all of these. Yeah, I should. 35 ain't shit. Yeah, just take this. It's something. These are an oh shit situation. They're in case of an oh shit situation. This isn't fun. That's neat. See, it's annoying that the Ancient of Days knows all this stuff is here. Even that, that dialogue there. It'll be weak to your lunar magic. Oh, good, because nothing else in here has been. Hmm. I could have done better, but I needed to blink. The choices that this game makes. I can't prevent it from doing that. I have to attack it. And then, see, I was trying to gather them up around it so I could use that because I knew it was going to do that. Really, I should focus on wanting to kill them. See, I knew it was going to do this and um, make my staff attack. It was going to make this crescent arc priority. I wish that poison attacks actually had a chance of doing poison, but I just realized this game doesn't have any status effects. Not the first. Look at that. I can't break him. I can't. I can't stop him from using his attacks.
I have something approaching a plan. I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to AoE heal with him this turn. Oh, shit. I reacted like that to that like it was doing the other attack. It's just as good to do this. I reacted to it like last time like it was doing that. This is annoying to me. This is a waste of a turn, but it just means I don't take that damage. Just like at all. And I guess that's better. I like this better. that that looks more like a spider than a toad it looks like the spider boss and mickey's magical adventure and i really don't like that the bosses no longer look like they're from cuphead Notice that they didn't make me choose to come to Mirth. They just needed time to pass, and so, well, now we've got Harvest Moon elements. Later. But not gameplay. So the next time I save, I can save. We'll call this the end of this video. Yep, that's like a whole three months, and it really is good that wheat, a uh, temperamental uh, grain, temperamental grass, really can grow in these arctic conditions, because, you know, the north is famous for being able to grow wheat all year round, you know, northern Europe, Scandinavia is famous for its huge grain yields all year around. I don't know what Kiln Mountain even is. But it's good to know that Garl is once again totally fine. No consequences to the story. Well, I guess he's not totally fine. I guess I jumped ahead by a few minutes. I got really excited when I saw that campfire because I thought it was going to let me save. But no, I gotta hit A a million times. This is the closest that this game comes to fucking... Gameplay.
Like, I literally like the gameplay in Brotato better, and you, there are no button presses. And so now he's like a good-hearted, nice guy, all of a sudden, because it's a Saturday morning cartoon and we helped him once, and so now his heart was completely changed from a loner dickhead, this is Malcolm that I'm talking about, from a loner dickhead to a selfless guy. Can we help? Can this be over any sooner? This isn't fun or interesting or cute. I didn't make that grain. I wasn't involved. It just happened. Yes, the giant bread offering into the volcano. It's good to know that it's hot enough to bake that giant ass bread all the way through, but not enough to kill you standing in the volcano with it. <coughs> Let's share more memories, okay? The power of friendship. Eight hours. All right, let's, let's just go ahead and skip it. Why don't I just hit R2 and skip the time that way? That would have been gameplay. And it would have been using our abilities to actually affect the story in a meaningful way. So no, we can't do that. Because that would imply that when you're using your Moon Knight power, that you're actually affecting time for other people besides yourself. It's a good thing this volcano is so untemperamental. It's also a conveniently made geological formation, unless they're trying to say that Malcomud is powerful enough that he shaped that whole volcano to have a bread oven. This dragon loves bread. Why can't I, why can't I skip this? I just want to skip it. I just want it to be done. I want it to be over. Why does he have a scar on his forehead? I don't want answers to these questions. Oh, I'm going to fall asleep. That would be the worst. Wake up with a 13 hour file. unprecedented act of goodness and kindness or whatever no one has ever done anything like this before even in the civilization that had clockworks hey well you know it turns out I don't owe myself a hand job not in here not in here Nah, hold on. That's how he talks. Nah, he's all. Wentworth is a city that I've never heard of. Stop! Ugh. 
And now it's never ending story. Because why not? Why shouldn't it be never ending story? That was in the 80s or the 90s or something like that. It's not even from like a cool perspective. And it's like five seconds. And now it's supposed to be like what he's got, like cancer. This is the perspective I was expecting. Save your energy. All these moments. I feel like the Ancient of Days just watching this happen. Why was it Garl that was punished when it was Sarai who threw the vial? He said an eye for an eye. Yeah. And now it's a completely different game. I can't skip this. Why is it this why is it this way? Why is it a different game? Because this is how it was this is how story was done in on the Sega. So now it's a Sega game like Star Ocean or uh, uh Shining Force. Yeah, this is isn't this how Shining Force I haven't played but like seven minutes of Shining Force. I played it just long enough to go, nope, I hate looking at this. Is it worth it? It's on the emulator here on the on the switch I'll, I'll play it if it's worth it i'd like I'd very very much like to skip this why isn't this how they presented the last 20 hours of the game you know i was bitching about how i don't like when jrpgs do this that this is how they're typically presented why didn't they just present this in the normal way that the game is presented and then why didn't they do the flashback sequences like this why didn't they do more of the fucking game as show and not tell? And why can't I save? Why have I why has it been so long? So many consecutive minutes of story. This is 15 minutes consecutive of narration. Narrative. And again, remember our, our narrator has changed again, again, again. Our narrator's focus has changed. Not only has our narrator changed, but now the very way that it's, per, it's shown to us has changed. Like, is, isn't what they would say in MST3K, uh, Mystery Science Three, Theater 3000, wouldn't they say, meanwhile, in another movie... Innocence, loss, and purpose gain. That's how we get our ultimates. God, I really hope that this is like gearing up to take us to the final boss of the game. Because I, Garl being dead is them killing the, the audience insert character. And to what end? What are they saying about that? What does that mean? Like, symbolically, what does it mean that I the the audience the the character that is is meant to represent me the audience insert character has been murdered by the game for no reason unjustly too it was sarai who did the thing that was punishable by death and so on that note thank you so very much for putting up with me putting up with this game uh, this has been Talking to Myself Gaming. I am talking to myself, and I'll see you. No, I won't. I may never see you, but you will see more of me playing this soon. Until next time.